Exactly one year after the Independent Electoral and Boundaries Commission, IABC, conducted a highly contested presidential election, the center seemed not to hold. Dr. Rosalind Akombe's unceremonious exit in October last year Thank you very much. was followed by the resignation of Conan Kada, Margaret Mwachanya and Paul Kurgat in April, leaving Chairman Wafula Chabukati and two commissioners, Boya Molu and Abdi Yakub Gulie. But today we have a quagmire. Because IEBC has currently constituted, has currently constituted, does not have the full commission plenary mandate. To resolve the stalemate at IEBC, the National Assembly's Justice and Legal Affairs Committee has drafted a bill proposing a framework of recruiting four commissioners to fill vacancies left by the quartet that resigned. I agree with you. Parliament have, has taken it too long, but uh, we want to fast track it within the next one month so that uh, uh, the country can have a legal regime that can be used to fill the four vacant positions. The select committee that recruited Chebukati and his team had heavy representation from the religious community, but the Legal Affairs Committee is proposing a broad based panel. The draft copy of the Justice and Legal Affairs Committee is trying to look at. Uh, do we put Kenya National Human Rights Commission, the Law Society of Kenya, Ethics and Anti-Corruption Commission, the Office of the DPP, you know, Public Service Commission, uh, just like the way we do with the other commissioners. The commission is without a substantive chief executive officer after Ezra Chilobo was suspended to facilitate investigations on how IEBC spent over 30 billion shillings in last year's elections. We, as we reconstitute the IEBC, through the IBC commissioners. We have always looked at the commissioners as a problem. We must also go to the secretariat so that we fix the secretariat and we fix the IBC commissioners. Chabukati and the two commissioners have dismissed calls for resignation and dared anyone keen on their removal to institute the rigorous process of kicking them out of office. Francis Gashuri, Citizen TV.